Hey guys, Spencer at Z1. Today we're taking a look at one of our most requested products uh, to bring to market, and that is the HR VHR flange header. Direct bolt on. This is targeted specifically for you guys with the 3.7 liter VHR or 3.5 uh, HR on a 350. But some improvements were made on these products uh, to bring them to market as requested, but also to make sure that we were doing better than our outgoing product line. Uh, we had a previous version, fabricated header set was very nice, uh, but it did require you to change everything after the cat to get it going. Uh, we wanted to address that first. After that, we wanted to make the focus on the 3.7, make more power uh, with these headers. So they addressed that step. They want to improve the price point, which we've done, and they wanted to make sure we made some improvements on performance. So zero um, compromise on the quality is kind of key here. And we're going to get into these details and show you why these stand out to perform better on your Z, 4G. All right, so let's take a look closer. So as you can see, these are constructed 100% 304 stainless. Uh, we've tooled up not only on these investment cast pieces that you see, which have helped uh, improve the transitions, they've also cut labor work a little bit and provided a more consistent product uh, from set to set compared to the outgoing completely fabricated set. The header flange is 10 mil thick. We've added holes around each port so that depending on your year, some of the positions of studs or nuts were in different places and it made it difficult to do the install. So we've made that accommodation to get that part on, cut some weight out uh, of the body of that part. We've integrated the transition from a more rectangular port to the round uh, tube shape without having to have a fabricator work on shaping the pipe and putting it in and trying to hold it consistent. Our team tooled up to get some specific uh, mandrel dies made also uh, in the shapes we needed to get this construction uh, possible. Um, and we beefed up the flange on the outlet side. The length of the headers is a significantly improved equal link match, uh, better than the outgoing, which weren't quite uh, perfect. These are within a fraction of a millimeter by design, and we don't see much variance in the construction on that. So the power and performance is better. Uh, even the exhaust note is different. If you hear these all the time like we do, you can tell um, usually a difference in a side-by-side -side comparison of which one has uh, which part if they're run through the gears. Kind of nice. Um, really scream. The header collector was reprofiled with a larger cross-sectional area to flow more specifically, so we're looking for more power, and it really is complementary in both NA and boosted applications we're seeing. Um, the transition is a little bit smoother as well, so not just uh, the cross-sectional movement, not just the smoothness of this transition, but also like the approach uh, for this is a little shallower, and all of that complements well. So we're seeing better scavenging, uh, better efficiency out of these headers great in applications that are NA or forced induction we're seeing. Uh, oftentimes in the past, we'd have vehicles come in with uh, superchargers on, they want to make a header change from factory manifolds. And oftentimes we're seeing a big boost in efficiency where power uh, normally, as soon as you do a swap would drop because boost will drop as the engine can move more air. Uh, but you can usually make just a small tweaks on the retune and get it cleaned back up so that it is making the same or now we're seeing more power in instances uh, at a lower boost level, so we're more efficient. We're running cooler uh, on the VHR specifically. Underhood and engine temps are a high uh, thing to combat already. We know we've got to add radiators and oil coolers to these always when we're trying to track them or use the revs for extended periods of time. And as we bolt on and push more power, uh, that is a tough thing to compete with. So if we can be more efficient on the engine set as a pump as a whole, we're seeing that benefit really help us reward um, long-term abuse where we were running cars non-stop on track or something like that. The flange on the collector is also beefed up uh, compared to the factory. Factory manifold um, has a mass-produced piece. They did get from the sheet metal stamped on the DE to a more tubular set, which was an improvement, but uh, the pipes are often crushed. Uh, they're not equal length. As far as the collector goes on the OEM products, even after the update, it's not uh, collector as we would per se. It's just kind of pipes jammed together in one near zone and just weld it up. Um, these do have kind of multi-layer in there that can fail or come apart if you're trying to use uh, with um, a single turbo kit or something like that. You're not going to be as risky at as much risk with uh, 
you know, something like this. It's built all 304 all stainless. Mandrel bent, they're back Persian construction, so really good penetration, very clean weld work. Um, there you have it. You've got bolt-on options now for your HR VHR application. You guys uh, asked for it. Our team went through. They tried to make some improvements and deliver. They were able to flow more, make more power, and cut the cost. So I think they did a really good job here. You guys have questions on this. You want to know, well, awesome. I want to get set headers. What's the next thing to go with it? How do I get my vehicle to the next level? I want to use it for this purpose, or I want it to sound or look like this. We've got you covered there, too. If you need anything on your ZRG for... Uh, repair, maintenance, OEM parts, aftermarket parts. You're looking for the best of the performance lines from other brands that we trust and love. We've got you covered on that. And if you're not so sure about a product that's uh, for your build or use case, that's okay too. No big deal. We're here for you. We've been doing this a long time. You don't have to experiment with your wallet to figure out if something's going to work or not. Just give us a call or shoot us an email. Our team's here for you. And they're enthusiasts just like you. They're happy to help. They want to take you to that next level. They want to see you achieve their goals very rewarding uh, career path that we're all on here that we get to work with our friends and help them achieve their goals. If you guys have questions, reach out. Otherwise, check the site. <laughs>